Hey guys, thanks for checking the video out. I want to take a look today at streamlining logic sessions, cleaning them up, making sure that everything is in the right place at the right time, because many people are now sharing sessions online and you want to make sure that there's not too much clutter, there's not too much kind of bloated audio files within your sessions that are going to cause download speeds to get slower upload speeds all that. There's a really simple way within Logic that we can just clean up our sessions and make them as streamlined as possible. I'm going to show you how to do it. So this is kind of a two-step process. Um, first of all, I've got a track here, which has got several tracks on it, it's going down to 83, including buses. And there's a lot of bulk in here, a lot of unused takes, a lot of stuff that's not made it to the final cut. And we can actually see that if we go over to our audio browser here, go into the project, and then go to edit and select unused. We can see all this stuff never made it to the final cut. There's absolutely loads of it here. So here's how you can get rid of this all in one go and make your session as streamlined as possible. So first of all, we're actually gonna do something that is just kind of good housekeeping. So let's go to project management and then consolidate. And we're gonna consolidate all of our session to one place. So that means if we're sharing sessions between people, then maybe there's stuff in our downloads folder that we just dragged in or whatever it is. There's stuff in different places and we wanna make sure that's all, everything that's in the session is all in one place. So we're gonna to go to consolidate project and then we're going to consolidate the assets into this project, okay? So let's go on okay. And that's gonna make sure that all the files that are referenced within this track are actually sitting within that main package. If you prefer to work in the kind of folder structure as opposed to the project package, then it's gonna go straight into that folder. Then we need to go to the same place, project management, and then go to cleanup. Now there's a few things we can do here. Delete unused files, yes, we wanna do that. Delete backups, well, maybe. And delete media browser files. So essentially, if we're at the point where we just want to be sharing this, maybe we're giving it to someone to mix, or maybe we're giving it to someone else to, to put their own parts on top of, then we want to get rid of all of these. So let's clean up all of these and just go yes to everything. So we can see this one currently sits at 1.96 gigabytes. So getting on for two gig for a session, pretty big. Let's go to clean up and see how much smaller we can get that. So it's gonna tell us about all the files it's gonna get rid of everything that isn't needed within this session. It's still gonna run exactly the same, still gonna sound the same. It's just removing all that bulk. Let's go okay. And it's just got rid of everything for us. So now we can go back to it and it's got rid of 500 meg, so half a gigabyte of just nonsense. So it's got rid of a quarter of that. It's got rid of 500 meg of stuff that just wasn't needed, wasn't actually anything to do with the session. And we've still got takes, we've still got take folders and everything. You see the base is still takes because that's still kind of within the session. It's just that it wasn't needed to make it sound the way it does now. Super simple trick if you're sharing projects, if you're taking projects from one computer to another, you want to make sure they're as streamlined, as bulk-free as possible. That's an easy way of doing it. I'll see you again soon. Take care.